Law enforcement is not a job you apply for to get a paycheck every two weeks. It's a calling. You know, people ask about the Brotherhood and what the Brotherhood means of law enforcement. And the long arm of the law is long and it's strong. I am willing to lay my life down for you if I have to. Because every scene that we go on, there's at least one gun there, the one we bring to it. You're there to put yourself in between them and harm's way. You know, you're taught from the very get-go that uh, there are bad people out there that'll hurt you. I'm going to do whatever I have to do to make sure that you and I both go home safe tonight. That thin blue line runs really, really, really deep. And that's that's what being a cop's about. When I first heard um, disbelief, it's like a dream. It's just like a, a horrible dream. As the sheriff, I can tell you that was probably the worst phone call I have ever received in my life. I've been a police officer for just under 10 years. Um, tomorrow will be the worst day in my career. Man, I'm gonna tell you something. I, um, I'd almost rather do anything but that. Her worst nightmare, the children's worst nightmare has come true. No, this is easy. Disbelief. You know it's true, but disbelief. You're numb. You don't know how to act. You, you know, you don't know how to react. There's nothing to cure this except time, and I don't think time will completely cure it. It, it was a punch in the stomach, to say the least. We're better people because we knew Kevin Carper. He loved being a part of something bigger. I can tell you that Kevin Carper was a Christian man. He was a family man, loved his kids. You can't have a bad family life and come to work as happy as Kevin was. Uh, you knew he was there for you. He was, he was a great backup. He truly was different. He was, he was always there to the end. He was just doing his job. He's doing what the citizens of this county pay him for. And I'm gonna tell you, Tuesday night, um, you know, it's, it's everybody in this department's worst fear come true. But when this happens, it brings it face forward, and you realize that it could be you. To see one of your own that has uh, given the ultimate sacrifice. You know, if you ever wanted a description of a hero, he's right over my right shoulder. We have had responses from all over the country. Some of these guys have never even met Kevin Carper, yet they're grieving because they, we've lost a brother. Did Kevin Carper do anything wrong that night? Absolutely not. He was doing what he was uh, trained to do. Without hesitation, without thinking of his own safety, he went into a situation where he knew he had to do something. Without hesitation, that's a hero. He paid the ultimate price to protect someone else. That's a hero. <laughs>